All right, now that I'm all finished with the Crack Vector, dropping in the OBR G340 or full mod engine, the G320RC stock engine, Zeno engine, is going to go in my Losi. So I've been cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. Everything's been taken apart. I haven't, since then, I've put it all back together partially here. Um, one update I've done is my Lunatic Rabid tuned pipe. It used to be blue. I used a high temperature paint. I know this paint works real good. Um, the updated paint, as you can see, is clear. So I have it clear coated. I know it doesn't come off. It's real good stuff. So that, that's been, been updated. And I also updated my fuel tank. I had a aluminum clipboard on the shelf. I saved it for the aluminum. And I bent it up to fit around my fuel tank to give it an aluminum look. I can't see spending 180 to 200 bucks on an aluminum tank for this thing, so I made I made my poor man's aluminum fuel tank cover. So I made that and what other updates have I done? The oh the the guards for the drive shafts. Made a couple of those. The ones I had were made out of a fiberglass material, and the fiberglass material was chipping and cracking on the edges. So I, I thought if I could just put a 90 degree bend on it, it would be okay. And I have those finished. So that's what I have so far. And to put the engine in, the stock, the stock CY 26cc engine, it came with this. I have the older Losi. Uh, 2014 I bought this. Yeah, I still have it, huh? So the, the CY, let's go over here on the table. The CY engine. You can take parts off of the CY engine and put on the G320. The part you can take off is this. So, so I uh, sandblasted, actually glass beat it. Sandblasting would have beat the crap out of it. So I glass bead this, put some new bearings in her. She's ready to go, but you can't use the stock G320 clutch housing because it's too long. Oh, uh, DDM sells a shorter version just for the low seat, and it's about 200 inches, 200 thousandths of an inch uh, less material on here. That way, <laughs> I couldn't think of what to say. So, so I have that. This is the original one. I have that. I bought from DDM. They sell it specially just for the low C. If you want to put the Zenoa G320RC in your low C, you'll have to buy that plate. One reason is you can't use the original one is the bearing size. See this bearing? And then that bearing, look how big it is. So that housing will not, the CY housing will not fit on the Zenoa G320RC engine. So you have to get another plate. Or if you're a machinist, you could skim off 200 thousandths, but I want to save this plate because uh, this will bolt onto the Baja, any of my, uh, you know, my 5B, 5SC, any of those, it'll bolt right on and you can mount the, the Zenoa G320 right in there. So I want to keep that plate just in case I need it. So I figured I'd buy one so I would have it. The engine could be universal if I wanted to change it. So that's what I have for that. And, oh, I just passed it up. I broke a piston in my shock, so I bought some pistons parts here, and I got my shocks here, I'll get those all finished, get them filled up, and I'm getting really close to getting this all finished, and hopefully we'll get her back together, but it, so far it's looking good. Bye, 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 bye.